So obviously uh, I'm not back home and I can't celebrate Halloween like all of you guys are back home. Well technically it's already night here so back home it's barely like what around 8 in the morning. So yeah. So normally um, I normally would do like some games uh, related to Halloween like scary games like The Evil Within or even Resident Evil 7 even though I stopped playing that game. Uh, I've been trying to bounce back onto it but it's literally I've had no time. That's not the point yet. So in honor of, you know, Halloween, I wanted to try something different. So what we're gonna try is the pumpkin spice Oreos. Now, um, a friend of mine gave me these and they are open, but I swear I haven't tried them. So this will be my very first time ever trying them. Yeah, I mean, let's, let's just see how it goes. I mean, it's really to Halloween. It's got a pumpkin in the corner, so why not? Go to try. Well, it's got the pumpkin spice smell to it, but let's try it. Not bad. So these are honestly, these are these are pretty good. I mean, if you're a fan of pumpkin pie, then you should be fine with this. I really, I rarely ever do videos like these where it involves food. I think the last type of food video I did was the uh, mac and Cheetos, and that was like a year, a year and a half ago, I think. And yeah, I mean, mac and Cheetos are pretty good, and obviously pumpkin spice isn't nowhere near being cheesy, but it's still pretty good too. I, mean, I was, I'm honestly genuinely surprised that it was pretty good. I was honestly expecting it to be like way different, but it's got a good kick of the spice in it and it's got a good pumpkin taste, so yeah. So if you guys ever see these at the store, I recommend you guys get them and try them for himself if you want to. I've heard that the... Um... Eventually. Oh, I can't remember, but all I know is that some of the uh, some of the flavors, the limited edition flavors that have come out for Oreos, haven't really tasted that good. Uh, there was like a gummy one that had to do with fish. Uh, I forgot the name of the brand, but that one turned out to taste nasty from what I heard. It tasted like medicine supposedly from what other people said, but yeah. Anyways, so I just thought I'd do something like this. You know, it's, it's the closest thing related to Halloween I can do. Uh, obviously gameplay, not yet, but yeah. Either way, hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys get the chance to get them, give them a try if you want. And also, Happy Halloween. Hope you guys are safe tonight. Please be safe. You know, honestly, things have been getting out of control back in the US. You know, but hopefully everything's fine. Hopefully you guys have a safe and fun time. Hopefully you guys get some candy while you're at it. You're never too old to go trick or treating to a certain point. <laughs> but uh, it's more of like, I don't know, you're never too old. You know, uh, you're always a kid at heart. There's nothing wrong with that. But you know, just be responsible. All right, now guys, uh, that's pretty much it. Uh, also keep an eye out for the World War II uh, premiere of Call of Duty. And uh, that's actually dropping on the third, I believe. Third or the fourth of this month of November. So we still have like a, a small amount of days left before that drops. And yeah, so keep an eye out for that. I'll be uploading a ton of that or I'll try to upload a ton of that. And also look out for some gameplay with my friends, my childhood friends. So you guys will get to hear them and see how they play. Uh, honestly, they've been rusty from Call of Duty because they, I believe the majority of them stopped playing after Ghosts. They really didn't even bother giving a... Uh, no, I take that back. They more or less stopped playing after... During Advanced Warfare. They stopped playing during Advanced Warfare and they just stopped from there. They didn't even really give Black Ops 3 a try. I was more of the uh, type... Myself and Aeon were the only ones who actually carried on with playing. Call of Duty. So we got to try Advanced Warfare. I personally didn't like Advanced Warfare that much. Uh, the game was like way too fast paced for my taste and I just couldn't adjust to it properly even though I prestiged like three times. Aegon was all right. Uh, we got to try out Black Ops 3. Black Ops 3 was amazing. Uh, it still is amazing. And uh, we got to try Infinite Warfare. Infinite Warfare and Modern Warfare Remastered. So I stayed, I sticked more with Infinite Warfare because I saw it that it was harder. It was a harder Call of Duty to play because it was even more fast-paced than um, Black Ops 3. So I stuck to it more. I'm actually a 6 Prestige on the Xbox version. And Aegon's, I think it's like a 2nd second, second or 3rd Prestige. I can't remember. But yeah, we didn't really play much of the Modern Warfare Remastered because it was just too campy. But from the small amount of gameplay I saw from the World War II beta, it's actually really good. And it keeps people moving. You can't really get a chance to camp that much in there. Which is, which is really good too, because that's the one thing people were scared of. And this uh, this next Call of Duty looks really promising. So yeah, so hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to give a like, comment, subscribe. If you guys thought the video was stupid, just let me know, honestly. Your feedback's honestly all I care about at this point. And yeah, also one more thing before we go, The Last of Us 2 trailer dropped. If you guys didn't know, I'm a huge fan of The Last of Us. The last, the first Last of Us that came out on the PlayStation 3 was the only reason I got a PlayStation in my life. So it was an amazing game. I still love it to death. 
I was doing gameplays on The Last of Us for the PS4 version. I stopped for a while for like abuse and stuff, but at this point it's more of like, you know what, I'd rather just I'd rather just upload it for fun. So keep an eye out for later on. My goal is to finish uploading the Last of Us walkthrough for you guys. So you guys can see how the first game is. Obviously there's only three uploads so far. So if you guys want to check that out or if you guys don't even know what The Last of Us is, you can still check those videos out. It basically explains everything. So yeah, that's basically what I wanted to touch up on. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoy it. So it's been lovely, guys. Be safe tonight. Happy Halloween. And hope you guys have fun. Later. This is so pretty good.